Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight. Welcome back to another episode of <clears throat> Europa Universalis 4 as Korea. Damn it. Uh, excuse me. I did tell you to attach to the boats, did I not? Apparently. Oh, crap. I lost. Which means my big fear has arrived, and yeah, the Russians have. They are. They are gathering. All right, so I guess that means the days of easy uh, conquest are over. I mean, I knew this day had to, it had to end sooner or later. I think I'm gonna maybe force march all these little stacks here as we merge everyone back together. Dang, I lost my, my one stack. Very sad. Alright. Let's not split apart too much at this point. Okay. Oh dear. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to... ...hold our own on this. Or maybe we will. Probably not, though. It looks like we might, but probably not. Though I am impressed. Okay, let's uh let's merge our stacks back together. I mean the fact that we almost uh we almost had them is pretty good. I mean we did some Pretty severe damage to them. The Commonwealth is actually doing some good work over there, but okay, there's a big Russian stack right there. There's no way they've got uh, much in the way of an army at this point, surely. So let's uh, again start uh, merging our stacks back together. As they start uh, sieging their land back, we shall most likely, I think, want to start... Well, no, these guys are... it'll take them forever to get there, so let's not worry about such things. And our big focus should just be on... oh, damn! Russia's actually slivering their way over here. Alright, well, could I... Hmm, how do I want to do this? Hmm. I'm gonna send you home. Okay, so you're, you're finally here. If we can send the boats... That would be great. Alright. Oh, and there's actually a little uncolonized strip of land right here that we should totally colonize. And yeah, you just stay there, because I'm going to send you home by the by. Okay, you guys are going there. You guys are working on gathering back. You guys are doing that. Damn it. <laughs> Stupid Yaren. Stupid Russia. Uh, no. You cannot have that land. That is my land. Oh, geez, where, where the heck did you come from? What? Wait, you guys were in the middle of breaking. How the hell did that happen? Okay, they're actually going to all split over there. And we'll, we'll merge them back up, and that should be okay. Alright, you can go down there. Alright, that was a uh, little bit bogus feeling. Okay, there's a 40 free stack, which means... Yeah, let's, uh... Let's send our guys up north. To actually start getting stuff done. 
Oh, oh wait, when did I get this extra merchant? We could have been doing stuff this whole time. Alright, so where do I want to put him? I mean, I guess over here, if we can drag more wealth. Hmm. But I think the way to do it would be to try to drag wealth over here. And then up here. And then over here. Alright. Transfer trade. Gonna get ourselves distracted for a little bit here. And yeah, I'd actually prefer if you did your stuff over there at the end of the month. Well, we'll come back to that if I don't forget. And I will almost definitely forget. So, you know. That'll be a thing. Alright, so you go here. Let's drop some... Uh, some infantry to start sieging back our land. Move you guys over here, and you can come back and collect our brave soldiers. Who are slowly attritioning to death for no reason over there. Damn Russians. Taking what should be rightfully mine. Alright, so we'll siege back our land, we'll catch up with these guys over here. Uh, these guys are... Damn, that's gonna hurt. And they're probably gonna come after us, so we wanna be vigilant. Let's, uh, gather our forces. Where are you going? Alright, so you should also slowly make your way- I'm gonna have you go here. You go here. You guys... Actually, I guess I should have you move here. No, oh, yeah, we'll, we'll move here. That way we're moving slightly off to the side and hopefully things work out. And where is our ships? Or where are our ships, rather? Be grammatically correct. Go, grab you. You're almost done. Excellent. This is all just a bunch of territory, so we're not terribly worried about it. Uh, okay, we can gain mandate. Nice. Kind of makes up for that uh, terrible roll earlier. All right, and you can kind of land you over here, maybe. Okay, and where are you guys going? They might be making their way towards Beijing, actually. We'll, uh, we'll see. But, yeah, we'll, we'll send our guys over there. Uh, we are capped out on admin points again. Is there anything I can spend my admin points on? Well, I guess I'll... I'll do that. Uh, mercantilism, no, that's Diplo points. Uh, I guess the only thing that's worth doing in this case would be to maybe buff our, uh, our Japanese provinces, because we can. Makes sense to me. I'll accept it culture anyway. Make, uh, make things great. Great-ish. Great enough. We buff our military a little bit. Alright, that's, uh, that's probably good enough. Alright, so we'll see what these guys are doing. Damn. All my work in Yaren being, uh, sort of... Wasted, I guess. Alright, good. So we're taking our, our territories back. Which is good. Our mandate is continuing to grow. Okay, the Pope is doing Pope things. Where are you going? Right here. Alright. So, you know, I'm going to see if I can catch up with you. Yeah. Oh, and there's some separatists, and that's that's perfectly okay with me. If the separatists wanna 
get caught out. Uh, you should actually stop there for a second. Uh, wait for it. Alright, now you can go over there and you're over there. Everything good. Uh, stuff is coming under the control of Korea again. That's always great. There we go. You guys move over there. Uh, the Yaranese and the Russians, they're, uh, they're continuing to do stuff. I think I'm actually going to move you over to this corner now. All right. You can march over here so we can kind of try and figure out what we're doing with that. Darn Yaren. All right, but we are wiping out uh, Russia's forces in a pretty good fashion. But yeah, I'm going to gather my forces uh, back over here. And what is this? Excellent. Now, it might be an idea. Oh yeah, you're just sitting here. Let's uh, get you over here now. It might be a good idea to focus on, um, you know, sieging or catching these guys first. But I feel that it will be acceptable if we, uh, yeah, just kind of re-siege back the stuff we've already sieged. Oh, actually, that's uh, not acceptable either. Didn't realize some of my land had been conquered. All right. All right, yeah, let, let's uh, see if we can catch these guys. They're going to siege that back, but there's no way that they're going to get out of that province before I get them. Or so I hope. And you can merge over there. You guys are doing that. This stack is going to try doing that. But we're going to crush these guys first. Brandenburg is allied with Russia. But they shouldn't be able to join this war. Well, yeah, they definitely can't. And I'll leave these separatists to do separatist-related things. Meanwhile, over here, Russia is doing whatever Russia does. But damn, they took this land and now I can't uh, tributarize them because they're too big. Wait, Commonwealth Vassal? What? No, I want you to be my tributary. Ah, uh, you know, we had, we almost had a good thing going there. But I guess instead I'll just, uh, you know, take all of this. What's this? A coalition? A coalition of Russia? Like I care. Oh yeah, actually I suppose I should be focusing on making sure we've got the Vajarian stuff. Rather than a bunch of stuff in the middle of, uh, you know, backwater nowhere. Oh, that's, that's already one of my provinces. <laughs> You know what? I actually also like the idea of taking a bunch of their money in order to further bankrupt them, basically. I like I like that a lot. That's good. We're gonna we're gonna follow that particular stratagem. Because it might even actually bankrupt Russia, and that would be amazing. At last we will have our revenge. Uh, excuse me, sir. What are you doing? Yeah, and the Separatists will, of course, continue to separate, which is generally just good for business for us. Our uh, various forces are over here. I mean, I wouldn't mind continuing to sweep over towards Russia, but then again, Mong Yang is doing God's work over there, so... I'm not gonna worry too terribly much. And where are you going? You are going up to Urkon. Which is a place somewhere. Wait, where is, where is, oh, it's right here. You know what, I'll, uh, I'll hit you up. And I will make you wish you had never been born, Russia. Which is kind of funny, seeing as we were playing as Russia in our last campaign. 
Uh, let's see, a free stability cost modifier guy. That's actually pretty good. 50% cheaper. Or we could, well, we don't really need the administrative power, do we? Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll take that. You know, mostly just because it's, it's such a nice thing. I can't say no to that. Then we'll split you guys apart. You'll wipe out uh, the Russians, possibly. Yeah, sure, have your ducats. Ah, I'm gonna get the crossing penalty, unfortunately, on that one. And you are wandering over there, so... Let's see if we can't catch you out. Treasure fleet has arrived, that's always cool. Okay, we are actually gonna catch them out, nice. And meanwhile, Russia is getting squished. Nicely done. Not entirely sure where they're gonna end up going, but it'll be somewhere out of my hair, so that's good enough. So mad, though, I really wish, uh... I could have tributarized them. Oh, you're uh, actually taking attrition, and I don't like that. All right. Actually, you know what? Let's. Uh, I don't know exactly where these Kazakh separatists are gonna go, but I do like the idea of uh, causing Russia continued problems. As they are our hated rival. Or something. There's something to us. Kind of got confused there for a second, but nope, that's French Brazil, not, uh... Can't colonize that, can't colonize that. That's all very unfortunate for me. Ah. And I don't really want to colonize this, as memory serves, because it's in a different colonial... Actually, that that's not... Oh, landlocked. Okay. Hmm. Ah, I really... I hate... I hate that. Oh, here we go. We'll connect Cascadia to, uh, California. That's good. All right. Good stuff's happening here. All right, and there goes Yaren's army. Gone forever. I suppose we could also start a war with the Oda at this particular moment in time, but I don't really know if I feel like doing that. But we always could. So maybe I will. But time will tell. For now, however, our big goal is... Uh, wasn't I moving a third stack? Maybe not that particular stack. Oh yeah, so here comes Russia's army. We are going to move up to meet them. And... Alright, I guess we can grab an extra diplomat. Now we've got so many subjects, might as well just focus on making them all love us forever. Alright, so you guys go in there. And when you're done, you circle over here. You're still going that way. Yeah, a couple more fights with Russia is probably what we need. And this, this is perfectly acceptable to me. Because again, if we can melt Russia... Which we sort of can. Then life is good. But it's going to take so long to circle over here, isn't it? Oh, you're making your way over. You know what? Change course. Don't need that anymore. Alright, Yaren is ready to surrender, but I am not ready to let them surrender. Mostly because, again, I still want uh, massive, massive Russian land. And also, uh, yeah, I want, uh, I want all their money in order to further cripple them, because I am sadistic that way. Yeah, Russia's, uh, Russia's falling apart here. I mean, they've got particularists, they've got... Uh, Non-particularists. It, it's all there. It's great. Great for me, anyway. Not so great for them. Yeah, and Russia's basically melted. So, with that in mind, let's start sending our boys back home. I don't think we need quite so many troops. In fact, I think we can safely uh, start letting our guys go back to drilling, which is good because it makes them faster and also stronger and many, many other things. 
Okay, Austria has re-allied with Russia, which is a big mistake for them, in my personal opinion. But you know what? They, uh, they've got to do what they think is right, so, you know, good for them. There we go. Never colonist. That's great. Again, unfortunately, we've got all this empty space in the world here that we can't see. I'm just going to focus on hunting this guy down. Uh, no. Don't really like that uh, one of our estates is kind of sad now, but uh, you know what? I've got a whole lot of money and we can uh, do these things. Also, we, uh, yeah, let's uh, continue getting the money. And we could also keep doing that, but universities, I think, are more important right now because we do want to make sure that, um, yeah, we are spreading uh, the Enlightenment when, when the Enlightenment comes. I don't know how much of this is going to go to Kazakh, but, uh... Yeah, they're, they're definitely going to break free uh, at the rate this is going. Mildly concerned by these guys, but see where, where things end up going. And, uh, yeah. All right. You, uh, you ready to call it quits yet, my good sir? Maximum of five loans totaling huge money. So, uh, yeah, basically, Russia deciding to defend Yeren, thinking that they could actually scare me from fighting, basically destroyed their country. So let that be a lesson to you. Don't defend other people. You'll just get hurt. Actually, it's a terrible lesson. Don't, don't follow that lesson, my friends. Okay, so this is all Muscovite culture, so we're actually... We're really getting in there, into the heartland of... of Russia. And having played as Russia previously, we know what Russia is like. Sort of, kind of. And, uh, yeah. That's a wasteland, so we'll just kind of continue slivering over here. But, I mean, this is all such low-quality land that I don't think it's dramatically affecting things for us. We might actually have to... Oh, jeez, no. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Damn you, Kazakh Separatists. I don't want to fight you. I'm actually going to beat them. No, no, don't do that. Okay, when can I... Uh... Okay, yeah, get out of there. I don't want to fight you. You stupid Separatists. Oh, right. I had loans. <laughs> I forgot about that. I could have paid those loans off, but... Uh... Instead, I renewed them. Not that it matters terribly much, but uh, that is mildly uh, disappointing for me as someone who likes to pay his loans back. Darn Russia. All right. Well, I guess another thing that's going to happen here is I'm kind of running out of places I actually care about colonizing, so... Yeah. I mean, I could start colonizing over here and form Korea and Canada. But I don't really know why I would want to do that. Though again, I could. But I don't think I will. Hmm. I also want to get some colonial wars going here, but I don't know if uh, that's actually ever going to happen. Because they don't want land, for whatever reason. Stupid colonies not wanting land. Ah, <sighs> could have ended this war so long ago. It's actually mildly frustrating. And you're still marching over there. A great advisor has died. Man, these guys are cheap. Uh, let's go with global 
Now, let's go for the younger guy. Are you an accepted culture? It is not, so I don't want you. Uh, you are an accepted culture, however. No, no, I'll, I'll take you. Nope, you're actually old. Damn, so I have to choose you. Well, no, I can take the 43-year-old guy. I just won't upgrade him much because he's going to die soon. Well, relatively speaking, I guess. All right. So this whole song and dance continues here as we continue. Huh. Gotta be honest, this is really turning into a slog. Yeah. But, uh, you know what? We're not gonna have to do a big war like this again any time. Oh, jeez. We're so close. I mean, I guess I could, I guess I could, uh, you know, maybe take less of your money. All right, all right, fine. If only to put an end to this nonsense. All right, so that uh, takes care of that, and then we just peace out with you in a second here. Okay, you know what? I actually would not mind just forcing you to be a tributary. I mean, you wouldn't give me much, but it wouldn't be terrible and it would save me the trouble of having to conquer you, which is always a good thing. And there we go. Dang it, Great Advisor died. But we can peace out and then we'll wrap this episode that did not want to end. Uh, how do I want to do this? Alright, that's, uh, that's a thing. That's a thing. And I'll leave you for later. Yeah. That seems good enough to me. What is our overextension? 35, so yeah, we can actually afford to do this. All right, so that's a thing that happened. Now we can just start coring everything and then we can go to war with the Oda and that'll be, uh, that'll be that. Oh, you guys aren't gonna stop sieging that land, are huh? That's, uh... Rather unfortunate for me, but uh, life goes on. And it's also time to wrap this episode up. So until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking and I will see all you in the next video.